this, this, is, this is a difficult thing because every time I tell people that we have a presenter, Nervi, how, how old are you? Are you five yet? My name is not Nervi. My name is Nervi. Nervi. I'm sorry, Nervi. I apologize. Nervi, how old are you? Five and a half. Five and a half. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Every time I tell somebody that we've got a student who's coming on who is five and a half, they accuse me of making that up. That can't possibly be true. So, and nearby, what are you here to tell us about today? Um, yeah, low humidity alert system. Wow, I cannot wait to learn more. Thank you for being here. Take it away. Yeah, it's a presentation now. It's a PowerPoint. Low Humidity Alert System by Nirbhay Arun, Richland, Washington State, USA. I live in a dry region of Evergreen, Washington State. We face challenges with low humidity, mainly during winter months. Low humidity challenges. Humidity amount is amount of water content in, in the air. Poor indoor humidity leads to serious health issues. Nasal congestion, dry eyes, frequent Frequent cold are some usual challenges. Ideal indoor humidity is 40% to 60%. Uh, My project, Low Humidity Alert System, to solve the problem of low humidity. To solve the problem of low humidity, I was curious to design a simple low humidity alert system. This alert system helps you, helps us to take preventive steps when preventive steps when indoor humidity is low. My project steps overview. Create humidity monitoring and alert set up using Arduino board, board develop block programming in Ardu block. Oops. Ardu, where's Ardu block? Ardu block. Development environment. Import and compile in the Ar Ardu Ar Arduino development environment. Digital humidity temperature DTH. DHT DHT sensor Did Digital Bother Module Arduino Board So now I'm going to open it Oh, 
So here is my project. So now I want to show you three things. One is the humidity sensor and the buzzer buzzer module and the Arduino board. So now from the humidity and temperature humidity sensor. The, the the humidity data come all the way from the humidity center and goes into my program. Now, 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 then, it, it sends a command from, from the audio board. Mm -hmm. Then, it sends it to the buzzer module. Then, the buzzer makes a sound. What about these two? And also, Laptop or Arduino board power supply. Connect cable with USB cable. Pop. Auto block de development environments. Oops. So here it's mostly a drag and drop. So now this drag and drop one right here. So now from this humidity sensor, let's start. This humidity sensor checks the humidity out there, then travels through the wires like cars and trucks go in the road, then now it goes to the humidity in a condition. If humidity is lo low than 40, the buzzer will, um, the, 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 a command will come, then it will send, send it to the buzzer. Then if the humidity is low, it will start bu uh, buzzing, but in one condition. When it's less than 40. 40. So, so this includes one before you know why I'm using this broccoli? Because I don't know C++. Do you know what? I, I, I do the program right here. Then copy it. Then paste it in the C++ program. So, demonstration. Human data goes from sensor to my program. My program checks if humidity is low. If humidity is low, my program sends a command to the buzzer to make a buzzing sound. So, and also, if the Program is correct. Make sure if your if the program is good with the hydrometer. If you have any questions, you may please talk.
Thank you. That was very good. That was very, very, yeah. very impressive. So I have a question. Are you planning to learn C++ or don't you need to learn it now? What? You had talked about learning C, right? C++. C++. Yeah, but I did not. Uh, you know what I said? I meant that. I meant that I meant that I don't know C++ but I I I just upload my my Blockly program. Yes, and you can convert it. Yes, I understand. Yeah. You might want to learn Python. Have you heard of a language called Python? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, I'm I'm learning Python with my terminal, Linux terminal. Oh. With Linux terminal. I, I have, oh, sorry. Go ahead, Jake. No, 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 go ahead. I'll admit, I have much less technical knowledge than the one and only Jake, and even than you nearby. Like, you are blowing my mind, and I'm having flashbacks to meeting you last October when you were sharing your program for Miro and another invention, I have to ask as a full-time kindergarten student, how do you find the time to take on all these projects? How do you manage all that time? I just learn programming with my dad every once in One time I asked my dad about Linux and one day I started loving Linux yes. and I also am also learning Python in my 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 my, my office laptop Your, your your office laptop? You have an office? Yeah. No, my parents' office laptop. <laughs> Actually, just for privacy. I I hope your parents are very good to you because then you will be good to them, and you may want to hire them once you become rich and famous. You should hire your parents. Yeah. No. I see there's a question on YouTube. Somebody is asking if you've thought of other sensors that you may want to add to your design that might yeah. be important. I, I thought uh, about the ultrasonic sensor with the, the buzzer module, I think. But you know what? I, I think... I, I'll, 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 I'll solve, solve lots of problems in my house. Uh, uh, one, uh, one in the kitchen, one in the bedroom, like my temperature humidity sensor. And you can also, if this sensor, now I, I took my, my sensor to low humidity in my in my in my next thing in my le next level I can also uh, change the program great because because it work when you change the program it will also start working for high humidity very good very good well, Nirbai, I, I can't wait to see what you're going to be doing next. We are going to be running gift programs throughout the year, so you'll have more opportunities. I don't want to put pressure on you, but we are expecting more inventions and more great ideas. So thank you very, very much for, for talking with us today. Thank you. Thank you.
Congratulations on your outstanding work nearby. Very impressive. Thank you. Thank See you. See you soon.